Hi there, Colin Gwynn here with DJI. And in this video, we're gonna take a look at the difference between flying your Phantom in attitude mode and GPS attitude mode. So the difference is pretty simple in that in GPS mode, you're actually using satellites in space to maintain the position of the Phantom. So if you're moving to the right and you center the stick, it's gonna kind of apply some brakes and then stop itself on a hover. Even if there's wind or anything like that, it's gonna maintain its position in space. That's in GPS mode. Now, in attitude mode only, it's just gonna maintain a level attitude of the Phantom. So if I'm flying into the left and I center the stick, it's gonna level the attitude, but it's gonna maintain that momentum and just drift or keep on drifting. Or if there's wind blowing, it'll actually drift down with the wind. Versus in GPS mode, it would lean into the wind a little bit and stop itself so it can maintain its position in space. That's basically the difference between attitude and GPS attitude. Now, some people like to fly in attitude mode because the, the craft sounds and flies a little smoother because it's not having to make all the little corrections to maintain its position. Whereas in, in GPS mode, it's gonna be making little corrections to maintain its positioning. So it doesn't seem like it's flying as smooth. So some people prefer to fly in attitude mode and that's just personal preference. But in the beginning, it's probably a good idea to keep it in GPS mode so that when you do let go, it stops itself. So let's take a look at that in, in action. I'm gonna have my switch all the way up, which is in GPS mode. I can see I have a green light telling me that I'm in GPS mode. Let's go ahead and take off and, and see what happens when we fly in and let go of the sticks. So we'll take off here, give it throttle. Now, if, I'm, if I come out here, in GPS mode, if I make a move, say I come from over here from the right, I come into the left, and then I let go of the stick, it's gonna stop itself. So again, we'll see that one more time. If I come in from the, from the right to the left, let go of the stick, it stops itself and maintains a hover. Now let's try that same thing in attitude mode. I switch here into attitude mode, and then if I start from over here on the right, I fly into the left, and I let go, it just keeps on drifting. So again, flying in this way, I let go, it's just gonna keep drifting. That's attitude mode. Now we can show that by starting a drift in attitude mode, and then switching into GPS while it's drifting. So let's get some speed, go into a drift, switch into GPS mode, and it's gonna stop itself. So that's the difference between GPS mode and attitude mode. Again, let's go to attitude mode. We're in attitude. We start a drift, switch into GPS, and it will stop itself. So that's the difference between GPS mode and attitude mode.